This is another example of a system used by men of a certain echelon of power and wealth to silence stories about them of all kinds. Ronan Farrow is describing catch and kill. It's the practice of buying the rights to an unreported story and intentionally never publishing it. We can't talk about catch and kill without introducing David Pecker. He's the chairman and CEO of American Media Inc., the parent company of this magazine. He's been a key player in the recent scandals involving President Trump. Back in 2006, Trump allegedly started an affair with Karen McDougal, a former Playboy model, while married to his wife Melania. Trump later denied he had the affair, but McDougal says the relationship lasted about 10 months. We saw each other <clears throat> a minimum five times a month. After McDougal considered taking her story public, Trump had his personal lawyer, Michael Cohen, set up a deal with David Pecker. Turns out Cohen recorded these conversations with Trump. I need to open up a company for the transfer of all of that info regarding our friend David, you know, so that I'm going to do that right away. The deal was American Media Inc., using money from Trump's lawyer, would pay McDougal for the rights to her story and require her to sign a non-disclosure agreement, effectively forbidding her from speaking about any relationship she had with a then-married man. AMI never published the scoop on Trump's alleged affair with McDougal, but the story was eventually uncovered by the Wall Street Journal. This week on Trump Inc., we're looking at the business of silence, how President Trump buys it, and what the cost is for the country. Listen wherever you get your podcasts.